here comes CSA. Oh, yeah. I thought it was Q471. Now they're saying it's Y129. I don't know. I'll figure it out. So this is either Q47114 or Y129. I have to actually break out and use the hollows today like I'm getting some insects on me. It's been a warm winter though, that's not surprising. I figured it coming in it would be Q470. I would imagine this is why 129. We'll figure it out later. No, they don't hurry through here. They're Y12914. So, I always thought a Y train was a yard train. Maybe not. Things have a little speed though, which is good. But he's still coming. So I can see the wheels going up and under these gondolas. Not like it just about sounded like a brake shot. His brake shot, that's what happened. Wow. Don't get to see that much. I'll tell you what. What we'll do is we'll cut it here. And when he gets started again, we'll get the rest of them. Uh, but he went into emergency. His brake shot, I heard that. All right, y'all. All righty, ladies and gentlemen. We are back. I moved down a little bit from uh, where I was at. Went and crossed Hamlet Avenue. What happened with this train? They had a air hose come uncoupled. 64th, 65th car. Which caused...
which caused the uh, the brakes to shoot. And we've got a couple of different trains. I've heard whistles coming from the yard, coming from the Monroe sub. And just uh, for the record, this uh, train right here is a Y129-14. I thought it would be 471, but I guess that's what I get for thinking. Go ahead and get this view of it as they pull on into the yard. Trying to look for the car at NOKLs, the first three letters of the uh, identification. Like I said, we're going to see a little bit of it again as I walk down a little bit. Just in case some other trains come in on the Monroe sub or departed or whatever. I know we got a Q471 in the yard. Still have that rock train. Sitting up in Raleigh Street. Like I said I think there's something else coming down to Monroe Sub. Could be Q61412. Looking for that car. bit of a air leak with that one. There it is, NOKL72501. That's what they shot, that's where they shot off at. Or that's the, that's the hose that, touched it, that become disconnected and caused the brakes to shoot. Right there. Hopefully they make it on into the yard this time. And in the crew's defense, wasn't anything they did. Apparently they, this isn't the first time they've had problems with those particular cars and the air hose coming uncoupled. I-129-14 is a pretty long train, especially going this slow, <laughs> aren't they all? Until it's getting to be the warm season, as I am now sweating.
Well, what we rail fanners put ourselves through. I'm either freezing my fingers till they're numb, or I'm drowning in my own sweat. Woe is me. Kind of is a it worked out a little bit. It actually kind of worked out to a certain degree that they did go to emergency because at least I uh, figured out positively who they were. Why 12914? Looks like some of the stuff we saw earlier on F742. the end. All right, y'all. That was Y12914. We had to stop there because his brake shot due to a air cable uncoupling went into emergency. But they fixed it and they're pulling on into the yard. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we will be back. <laughs>